In this tech tip video, I'm going to demonstrate how to set up Verica to your preferences by editing the ribbon. You can edit the ribbon by right clicking in it and selecting Customize Ribbon. You can add commonly used commands into groups and tabs that make sense to you. For example, let's add the sectioning command in a new group in the Excalibur tab. Click on the group where you want to add it, click on New Group, rename the group to Section, You can filter the commands by using the drop down at the top of the screen. Choose the command from the left hand column and select Add. You can remove unwanted or unused commands in order to clean up your ribbon. One thing to keep in mind before turning off these commands is to make sure that you know if the button is useful or not before doing so. You can always press F1 to read more about what the command does before turning it off. You can also change the size of icons by selecting the command and then selecting the desired size. You can also add your own buttons by clicking on the Customize button. First I'm going to add a new tab and group and name them both Calculator. Add the name of the button. In this example, I will be adding the standard Windows calculator. For the text, I will call it calculator. I have a PNG format icon and I'm going to navigate to the executable path for this application. Click Add in order to add this custom button to the ribbon. Let's customize the Quick Access Toolbar. In this example, let's filter by analysis and I will select the Auto Diff button and add it by using the Add button. This is a good place to put your most used commands. Next we will customize the pop-up menu. You can add items directly to the radial menu or you can add items under a new menu. Click on the new menu button. Name the menu item and click Rename. In this example, I'm going to add some Excalibur commands. We can filter the commands by selecting Excalibur and choosing the commands that I'd like to add. Now add items to the new menu by using the Add button. Click OK to accept changes. Note the new menu item along with the three commands that were added.